Wilson go. with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke. Allie LaForce, our reporter. And this is their first time matched up with the Celtics this year. Last season, they just couldn't find a winning strategy against this squad. Robert Williams. Williams' shot is good. Oh, it's a marquee showdown tonight, Doris. Two of the elite teams in the league. B.A., there are certain regular season games that both players and fans alike will circle the calendar. The fans are fired up. The players were excited at shoot-around. This one we had to watch. Six to shoot. Green for three. The kick out to Williams. From deep. The rebound by Wiggins. Here's Golden State. Here's Curry. Here's Looney. Oh! <laughs> That's what we call a power finish. There's no such thing as gentle for the big man. Smart with the ball. He's averaging more than 12 a game. A consistent threat on offense. That's a shot he'd like back. He's usually going to make those. And looking at the career of Curry, his legacy is set. The titles, records, numbers all cemented him as a legend. While we love his ability to attack the rim, he just loses a little bit of focus and misses the chippy. On the wing, Green. On the wing, Curry. Back to Green. Tatum with a steal. It's Brown on the wing. Down low. And Horford powers it home. Well, what a pleasure to watch Al Horford go to work. Does all the right things, and that time gets an easy dunk. At times, some have doubted Curry's legacy. Hard to make a case against him, though, in my opinion. <laughs> I agree, B.A. He has produced in every capacity. It's just a matter of how great he is. One of the top three point guards of all time. Here's Smart, following the score by Golden State. And he buries his first look. And this is where Marcus Smart has gotten so much better at reading the defense. He sees an open lane, and he attacks it. And Williams over to help. Pass to Looney. Thompson outside. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Thompson. And here in the first, about three minutes in. Two minutes remaining. Outside Tatum. Two minutes. Smart outside. Right side Tatum. Clock at six. Kicks it out to Smart. Here's Brown. And it's going to be a 24-second violation. They turn it over. Basketball. Celtics up. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in this first quarter. Outside Payton. Driving to the basket. Pass to Kaminga. Bielita outside. Uses the glass on the layup. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? To me, that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Williams on the wing. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Williams. Warriors basketball. We've got 108 left in the opening quarter. Seems like this offense is being executed the way it was designed. Yeah, I'm sure Coach couldn't be happier with the results. To the middle. Here's Kuminga. Takes the assist and lays it in. Nice setup. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. Williams with the screen. And Pritchard, here we go. Off target at the rim. The Warriors leading. Fires the three. It's hauled in by White. 
Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. And here's Brown for three. Boston, no good that time either. Pool outside. They set the screen. Inside. Here's Kuminga. Left side, Peyton. Three pointer, no good. The open shot, White. Oh, and he just knocked down the buzzer beater. Makes his selection just in time. Well done. Well, finishing quarter strong. Every coach preaches it. Nice work. 15. Ladies and gentlemen, your Warriors. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even on the scoreboard so far. All right, guys, what do you think so far about the offensive approach for the Warriors? Guys, right from the start, it's been apparent they're determined to establish a presence in the paint. I think the other thing they've had going for them is their passing. Plenty of their baskets have come off assists. The kick out, Curry. Over smart. Curry's shot is off. Boston trailing. Boy, we have seen Jason Tatum improve each and every year. Not just his productivity, guys. He's so skilled. But it's the leadership. It's the maturity for his age that's really striking. The defense, they're doing whatever they can to protect the rim. First team foul. Shooting for Boston. Jason Tatum. Taking two shots. And the first one at the line is good. And Doris, Tatum's acumen as a playmaker now is leadership by example. Well, championships are won with unselfish play. His teammates have developed their games as well. This guy now trusts them and wants to make sure everybody's involved. And we creep towards the MVP being named. Doris, what was the closest MVP race you can remember? Well, I mean, for me in recent history, 2017, when James Harden and Russell Westbrook were battling it out, and it was Russell Westbrook averaging a triple-double that really pushed him through to the other side. Outside, green. Wiggins has space. Shot is good off the back rim and in. Strong pass there to set up the basket. Smart outside. The kick to Tatum. Just five to shoot. The fadeaway is good. Jason Tatum. Tatum's got four points this quarter. You know the coaches hated that shot, but guess what? Some of them go in. Outside Curry. From outside, off the mark. And you never want to give a shooter like him a clean look. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. Brian, we know that Stephen Curry generally is regarded as the greatest shooter the game has ever known. He said for him, quote, it starts with a great base and foundation and allows everything to feel perfect. The perfect shot feels effortless to me. Serene and quiet. It's only me, the rim, and the basketball. Powerful words from Stephen. It is a thing of beauty, Allie. Excellent. Here's Curry. Hits the front of the rim and out. And Clay Thompson picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. That's his first personal The Celtics foul. making a switch here. Second team foul. And here in the second quarter of action, just a hair under two and a half minutes played. And once he gets to the rim, it's fairly automatic. Nothing fancy right there. Just takes his two points, moves on. Pass to Thompson. Three-pointer. Can't get a second shot to fall. Now one of two. The Celtics with the lead. There's Tatum with the three. And he can't sink that one. He's two for four in the contest. And out of bounds. Boston will have it. The Celtics making a switch here. Checking in for the Celtics. Three minutes of action thus far in the second. Let's it fly. Boston again missing. Wiggins with it. Guarded now by Williams. The kick out to Wiggins. And stolen by Williams. 
Pass to Pritchard. Williams with it. From deep. That one goes. Now he's one for two. And breaking down some numbers here. The hustle stats for Boston. Their frenetic defense has been impressive. Putting ball handlers on the defensive and turning them over as well. Yeah, and I think the other thing that's helped them early tonight are the points they've gotten off turnovers. Golden State foul. And the whistle blows. And it's going to be on Jordan Poole. That's his first, that's his first foul. foul. And the Warriors making a switch here. Substitution for your Warriors. Otto Porter. Gary Payton, the second. Timeout Warriors. Ladies and gentlemen, your Warriors dance team. Just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Williams. Williams. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Where was the defense? No fighting through the pick. No rotation. My goodness. Pass to Williams. Williams in the post. Williams punches it home. And it's so hard to stop the putback when you let him live at the rim like that. Boy, once he gets his hands on it around the rim, it's too late. How about the activity level, the effort level? This team right now feeding off his energy. To the paint. Here's Kuminga. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. And you like the balance here. Not just falling in love with the free ball. Well, you see Jason Tatum rise above the defense and leave, no doubt. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Jaylen. A nice shot by Brown. And their offensive execution has really picked up here in the second period. Pool from long range. Offensive rebound. Fires from deep. Kept alive by Boston. That's the end of the first half with a score. Your Warriors.